Hello and welcome to the wonderful world of English language classroom. Learners of classes 11 and 12. Learners, we are doing study skills today, note making, subtitling and summarizing. Learners, we have done the part 1 of this note making in the last session, last episode. We will move on to do another today and first we will take up a text and make notes out of it. Then we will move on to understand how subtitling is done and of course, uh, we will move on to do uh, summarizing. Learners, I know that you are all occupied with your subjects physics, chemistry, biology, mathematics, commerce, accountancy, history, political science, many more, many more subjects. But let us also not forget that language is as important as any other subject and you need to do activities, read and prepare yourself regularly. You, may, you should not think that I will do it towards the end, end and before the examination that will uh, cost you a lot. So, do it, be consistent and do it. Okay, learners, uh, enough of advice. So, let us move on to take up your text and do uh, make notes. And learners to do this note making with me is Kriti Gautam and I am Meghanathan from the Department of Education in Languages in CRT and of course, learners you are all with us and I expect you and I request you to please do the activities as we do and everything we are going to do and learn. Okay. Come on, Kriti. Yes, sir. Uh, let us take a look at the notes we made in the last session. Okay, here are the notes you made in the last session along with the learners. So, what are they? What are there in the notes? Sir, we, we tried to make notes hmm. and for which we have followed a particular format in which we gave a heading. Then we moved on to the title of the stanza or paragraph and then their notes related to it and then subheading, sub subheadings. Fine. All right. Be before you started making notes, you did something else. What did you? You read the passage read of course. The passage. Without reading, yes. you can't do. Yes, and sir. also, you underlined keywords, keywords. and important topic sentences. Yes, sir. So, learners you must know when you read something, you must understand what is the main idea and which sentence most likely conveys the topic sentence, the idea, main idea of the text. Then we move on to underline the keywords. Keywords, so yes, key sir. So, keywords are important and they are content words through which we understand the text. So, do, she brought those words as heading, subheading, sub subheading. This is what we are going to Come on, let us take up a text today. What, which text you are going to do? Sir, we are doing a text related to human family. Okay. So, this is a kind of uh, literary description. Yes, yes, sir. Come on, learners. The text appears on your screen, at least uh, one paragraph and, and Kriti is going to read out to you and of course, you should be reading and it is not reading out to you. Uh, you should be reading. Then she will underline the keywords and the important sentences are the chunks of words which will form the notes. Come on, let us do it. Sure, sir. At least the first paragraph. It is a big one. Learners, just follow it up, uh, uh, whatever she does. Yeah. Hmm. The once spent two months taming a small lizard rescued from Bedouin Arabs of the south till he ate from my hand and knew me. If he was frightened, he would swell himself out to the shape of a miniature balloon and shrink again at the touch and the safety of my hand. He has small bright triangular black eyes and would hold his head on one side and look out of them with a pan like wisdom, gay and remote from ours and for me alone when I stroked him these eyes turned suddenly round in their sockets. This is a strange but according to books natural way for lizards to express affection. This text is about? Lizards. This is a very, very interesting, strange yes, kind of. Yes, sir. Please go ahead, go ahead. The small reptile body had to die unless the sun's rays warmed the blood that runs differently from ours. Yet human qualities of curiosity and courage were strangely vivid within it. He crouched as still and small and flat as he could make himself under the shadow of a bird overhead or of an aeroplane which he obviously held to belong on the same species. Yes, a good description of the lizard. Yes, sir. Okay, okay, okay. But he was ready to pick up his meal where he left it as soon as the shadow had passed. 
okay. and to round their garden nibbling at plants he had never known before. As I watched him, I found it pleasant to see these human things courage, fear, affection, anger tracing back to a pedigree immensely more ancient than ours. Very good. So, the, 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 the writer, yes, the sir. text says that lizards also as human as we are. Yes, sir. Right. Now, uh, learners, this is the text for you and in examination you may get much longer a text, maybe 250 words. This may be 150 words or 100 words, but let us pick up this paragraph only from this text. It is an unknown text I picked up from somewhere. Now, it describes lizard and what else? Its movements and its life. And the emotions which the lizard is portraying and they are comparing the lizard's emotions and behaviors to a human. Fine. So, now what are you going to do? Sir, I am going to underline the keywords. Fine, and try to find the topic, topic. sentence, the yes. main main idea. Sir. Yes, sir. Learners, now Kriti is going to underline the keywords and topic sentences in order to understand the main idea of the paragraph. Come on, go ahead, do okay, it. Okay, sir. Do it. Small lizard rescued Bidion Arabs of the south. Eight from hand, frightened, swell, shape, miniature, hmm. balloon, shrink. Uh, let me let me stop you again. Yes, yes sir. again. Uh, you need not underline everything. Okay, so, sir. only keywords. Okay, keywords. sir. Okay. Keywords which convey the idea. Fine. Okay, All sir. right. Go ahead. Touch, small, bright, triangular, black eyes head, pan like wisdom, gay, mm -hmm. stroked eyes, strange. So, the animal is strange. Okay. Yes, sir. Mm. Express affection. Great. Reptile body. Mm -hmm. Sun's rays. Warmed blood, mm -hmm. human qualities, curiosity, courage, for pleasant. Two, okay, for two lines you do not find anything very important. Yes, sir. Great, great. Human things, courage, fear, affection, anger tracing, ancient. Okay, fine learners, this is how uh, she has made uh, the underlined the key words uh, of this. Now, uh, you are going to do the rough work for making notes. So, come on, let us move on to do the rough work. Okay, sir. So, I will start with the heading, para heading, hmm. number 1, lizard rescued, under this I can write a small lizard from where from Bidion Arabs of South ate from hand the lizard ate from hand yes sir okay then, sir, secondly, I would write shape. In this, I can say shape of miniature. Mm -hmm. Under this, sir, I can give a sub sub heading. Mm. Now, in the rough, you, you bring the points only, okay, the sir. later you decide. Okay, sir. Hmm. So, I uh, under a shape of miniature, I will say swell into balloon. Then? Then I would say, sir, shrink. at the touch in 
then I would say small mm -hmm. bright triangular eyes then I would say so emotions like human. So, it, it was like human? Yes, sir. So, under this sir I can write shows affection. It showed affection? Hmm? Yes, sir. Like humans? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Then I can write sun rays. Mm -hmm. warmed the body like but sometimes we humans sit in the sun in winter and warms ourselves very good you got all the all the ideas yes sir hmm. thirdly human qualities so it was like human yes sir so you need not bring two or more points on one aspect only one okay sir you may when you finalize you may uh, club uh, some other points and to make make it as one point or one sub sub point. Okay, sir. All right, all right. Go ahead. So under this, I can also write, like you said, sub sub point, curiosity, courage. Then, sir, I can also say um, fourthly, human aspects in lizard. So, sir, in this I will write that the lizard was courageous. Emotional? Yes, sir. Emotional anger, showed anger. And uh, fifth, ancient. Sir, I finished with the rough okay, Very good. You, you have done that. Fine. Now, you have made five points. Yes, sir. I am going to ask you, why five points? Sir, I made five points because I wanted to bring every idea I had into this note. Very good. Well done. Well done. Now, uh, learners, the idea is, the, work, the aim is to bring in all the aspects of the text, at least in the rough work and you may discard some of the ideas in the fair work. Okay, sir. The, at the end of the day, you are going to make notes out of it, not just description in pointers, that is one. Now, uh, the first point, second point, third point and it nicely moves. Look at it, first point is the narrator rescued a lizard. Then he describes second point, shape. Third point, how it behaved, human emotions. Then I, I have problem with the, you cannot simply give one point, uh, one main point and leave it at that because okay, any sir. main point will have sub point. So, you may club the fifth one that is ancient into fourth one. Okay, so, sir. learners doing rough work is very important even in examinations. We will discuss it later why, how you can take time, make time for this in the examination. So, read and do the rough work, that is important. Now, she is moving towards to fair work. In fair work, I have to make sure that I put points, then I give sub points and then I also give sub sub points. I also have to use abbreviations or symbols wherever possible and uh, I will give a heading also at the end. Very good. But that you are giving at the end, learners can give before also. Yes, sir. Yes, All sir. Right. Fine, fine. So, I will begin with note making. So, point number 1 would be lizard rescued. Under this main point, I will give a sub point, a small lizard.
another sub point 1.2 rescued from Bidion Arabs of the South and the third sub point eight from hand. So, the lizard was eating from the narrator's hand. Then my narrator's hand or lizard's hand. Sir, the lizard was eating from the narrator's hand. Okay, all right. Yes, hmm. sir. I was thinking when I read first, it was uh, the lizard itself is eating from itself. Okay, sir. All right, all right. Fine. You got the point. Second point, shape. In this, I will make a sub point. A shape of miniature. I will give a sub sub point under this 2.1.1 swell into balloon then second sub point shrink at the touch And third sub point, small, bright, triangular eyes. Then third point, emotions like human. Under this, I will make a sub point. shows affection three point two another sub point sun's rays form the body and then I will move on to the fourth and the last point that is human aspects in lizard. So, I will write down that the human aspects in this lizard were that the lizard was courageous like human, it was emotional. then showed anger like humans and then I will also say that it was curious and ancient. So, like ancient human being? Yes, sir. Okay, through the process of e evolution? Yes, sir. All right, so, lastly, it. I will also give the heading. So, to this note making, the heading I will give is Pideon Lizards. Okay. So, if I have to ask you to give another title. Yes, sir. What will you give? Sir, so, I can. talks about human aspects, you know. Yes, sir. So, what will you give? Sir, I can also give lizards like humans. So, lizard, uh, lizards, the humans. Yeah. Okay, yes, right. sir. Fine. All right. Anything? Learners, uh, the idea is uh, the suitable heading. Sir, I have finished the final. Uh, fair note. note. Fair okay, all right. note. Well, well done. So, let, let, me, let me appreciate you. So, Thank well you, done. Sir. Well, very good. Well done. Learners, this is how uh, CS made the notes. So, we hope and we believe that you also have done the same way or your own way, but the, given the format and the ideas to be brought in. Now, do you think that uh, all the points of the first paragraph of the text about lizard you have brought in? Sir, I missed one thing. Hmm. Sir, in the first point, lizard rescued, 
I, I have mentioned the narrator. So, I will write lizard rescued by narrator. Hmm. By the narrator or since the text is in first person narration by me. Okay, sir. All right. Learners, you should not change the main idea and the tone of the passage. Okay, sir. Text. Because you are not reporting it. You are only making notes out of it in order to understand. Okay, so, sir. that's well done. From that point of view, I think your notes is uh, very well done. Thank now, you, sir. Now, let us take a look at um, two things. Okay, One sir. is learners, you should learn and of course, you must have known, you must have learnt how to subtitle, a uh, title and subtitling a note. All right. So, in that case, let us look at the first one and you read the first ma main point. Sure, sir. Hmm. Lizard rescued by narrator. Okay, that is the major idea of the first part of the text. Yes, sir. The passage. Then let us go into the sub points. A small lizard. Okay. Then sub, uh, second sub point. Beyond Arabs of the south. Then. Eight from hand. Okay. Look at learners. The main point, the narrator rescued the lizard, a strange animal. Uh, what is it? Reptile we call it. Yes, sir. So, they must have known because they must have studied science uh, from class 9, 10, many, many years. Then the narrator moves on to describe its physical structure. Yes, sir. So, Kriti has rightly chosen one major point that is how the lizard looks like. Fine. All right. Very good. Now, let us draw the attention of learners to one important aspect of note making, making a note is main point, sub point, sub sub point. You can see it on the screen how she has uh, done it. So, let us look at the second um, main point. Why and how did you choose this? So, because the shape of the lizard was described so from, from in various ways in the passage. So, from that I make out that I should write shape as a Heading. Second point. Second point. Sorry, so, sir. second sub, uh, second main point. Yes, sir. Then second uh, uh, main point, sub point is a shape of a miniature, what? Uh, it it look like a miniature triangle or something. Yes, no? yes sir. So, uh. sh a shape of a miniature hmm. swell into balloon. Uh, it can, it can swell into balloon. Yes. So, sir. balloon you have drawn. Yes, the sir. balloon. Very good, yes, very good. Sir. And uh, like that. Then look at the uh, two point the third point in two that is 2.3 read it out small bright triangular eyes and so triangular eyes you, eyes you have you have made a symbol yes so sir. learners uh, either symbol or uh, or um, abbreviation at least 3 to 4 you have to use it and she has used it very well now now look at the third let's move on to third point what have you written emotions like human okay and the, now the writer takes the reader from describing the physical structure to its emotions, something the next point. So, you have taken that. So, 3.1 is? Shows affection and the second point 3.2, sun's rays warmed the body. Uh, the lizard uh, bossed under the sun to yes. warm up the body, the yes, way sir. humans do. Yes, sir. Then fourth point? Human aspects in lizard. Okay. Go ahead. Fourth point 1? Courageous. Hmm. 4.2, emotional. Hmm. 4.3, showed anger. And 4.4, .4, curious and ancient. Okay, I am going to make, ask you whether we can make some changes in the four point, four sub points of the fourth main point. Look at it, courageous, emotional, showed anger. If I were to write, I may club this. Yes, sir, we can do that. Yeah, so, courageous, emotional and showed anger. The, hmm. This all coming under human emotions. Then the last one, curious and ancient may be separate point. Okay, so, sir. this is my suggestion. Uh, it is fine. Otherwise, well done. Learners, now look at uh, the screen how to title and subtitle it. Uh, before we move on to do that, uh, you have g given a heading also. Yes, sir. What is that? Bidion lizards. Okay. So, why did you give? Sir, because in this passage, the description was about Bidion lizards and how they are similar like humans with the uh, emotional aspects and the uh, human aspects in the okay, All right. Let me ask you a question, maybe some what's it, mischievous question. The, the writer wants to convey as he found a lizard and it behaved like human and more of human than a kind of creeper ani uh, uh, what's it, um, animal. Uh, so, 
can we think of bringing do that aspect into the heading? Yes, sir. We can do make some changes in the heading. Uh, how? Lizard, the human, like lizard, like human. So anything. Okay. So he heading has to convey the actual message of the passage. So I would give full marks to you. Thank but you, however, sir. we can make the headings attractive. Fine learners, and uh, thank you, Kriti, again. Thank you, sir. Now so much, sir. we also have to tell the learners how to give main points, titling, and subtitling. So. It appears on your screen, one main point, one one sub point, one 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 sub sub point, still you have another sub point, one 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 uh, sub sub point, then two main point two, then two point one sub point of main point two. So, like that it goes on, you can see the structure and you may follow any format, but you have to structure it main point, sub point, sub sub point, that is what. All right, uh, uh, Kriti, yes, sir. You believe that learners have understood note Definitely, making? Definitely, sir. I have I understood. Do believe that. Okay, I have understood because you have really demonstrated it. Thank you so much, sir. Okay, another important thing is using the abbreviations. Now, in examination, I have I am a student of class 12, 11. I am asking you a question. You have to clarify me. Okay, sir. You have done rough work. Yes, sir. And the then went on to make the fair, fair work. Yes, sir. Uh, and that is the final one. So, do will I get this much time in examination? No, sir. We have to directly move on with the. No, fair no, work. no, no. Uh, that is what my point. You please do the rough work, but quickly you do it. Okay. And okay, in English, exa English language examination, particularly, no child so far complained that time is short. They may have said in sometimes in physics, chemistry, okay. uh, mathematics, but not in. English. So, you have ample time, 3 hours time and nowadays they are giving some reading time uh, reading well. time for what is it? Uh, reading the question paper. Uh, 15 minutes. 15 so, minutes. in a yes, way you sir. are getting 3 hours 15 minutes. No yes. examination on earth is beyond 3 hours. So, thanks to the boards now they are giving 15 minutes extra. So, you read the text, reading comprehension text and this text twice in this 15 minutes then move on to do other things. So, it is important to do rough work not only now, okay. whenever you write something in life academically for any representation, you do the rough work and think it, then you start writing. Okay, sir. All right. So, let us close it uh, uh, by thanking you as well as the learners, but let me give them um, two assignments. Take up any text from newspaper, particularly editorial page, the main page, some article or even the editorial itself, then move on to do read twice, thrice, then do the rough work, then the fair work and show to your uh, teachers, your peers, you can send to us also, we will give you feedback. This is how note making is done. So, let me thank you Kriti again. Thank you so much, sir. For having participated actively and, do, uh, the, and, and have done the activities and let me thank the uh, learners for their active participation. And we hope that we have learned something today. Uh, we will meet you in the third episode of Study Skills Note Making, in which we are going to learn how to summarize the notes made. That is important aspect, because the 8 marks question, let us also talk about marks, the number also matters, 5 marks for note making, I think 3 marks for summarizing. So, summarizing we will see in the next episode. Till then, thank you very much, take care.